hospitals nationally where they've got a shortage of nursing staff. On Wednesday this week we see an irate ophthalmologist who had just been told that the eye clinic in the clock tower are shut down. So what we're doing, we're carrying out our promise, we're going to occupy the hospital. Yeah, I'll make them. Any of these departments. No, but I'll make them on the week after. Six hundred odd staff between Chase Farm and Barnet Hospital, admin staff, are having to reapply for their own jobs. Okay, okay. Out of that six hundred, up to three hundred and fifty are going to get the sack and find themselves unemployed. We say that's unacceptable. These cuts and closures are unacceptable. So we're asking you. To support our occupation, we've got. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 We're asking people to fill in. Stop it up there, you're covering us in rubbish. <laughs> People with clipboards asking for volunteers that are prepared to come in here because we're keeping up a 24 hour occupation of Chase Bar. Um, my name is Mrs. Atal. I'm one of the surgeons at North Middlesex Hospital. We recently retired. We need our district general hospitals. We cannot manage without them. They care for 97% of the common emergencies. We've got to keep every department here A and E, maternity, paediatrics, intensive care, patients, the whole lot. <laughs> Yes. We can't go miles to a specialist hospital yes. 
Yeah. 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 Yeah.